Well, this is June Aunt Lewis with Living Wealthy Always. And of course, we are at the Delta Seminar Dinner. And this seminar dinner is actually really for Delta opening up a line in Grenada. So now there's going to be flights to Grenada. And we've had several speakers come up. They're introducing the island, talking about the benefits for the island. So this particular event is mainly for travel agents and people that are in social media um, or media period. We're just talking with some of the people that came out. Of course, most of them are Grenadians, and we're proud to speak with the Grenadian people because obviously, who are the people we're going to talk to about the about Grenada? Well, I think uh, one of the things uh, that make me so proud is at least Grenadians are going to get a chance to have more options traveling to Grenada from here in Atlanta. Uh, in the past, I traveled to Grenada. I'm only open to American Airlines. Now we have another option on Delta, and I, I hope it will be another gateway for people on the travel to Grenada to use Delta. Now we have Mr. Rayleigh and you're actually with Sandals Resort. Yes, I'm the business development manager for Sandals Resort in North Georgia. Well, this is a huge milestone uh, for Sandals. Uh, Grenada is an amazing island. We're very happy to be there. The Grenadians love us. They want us there. And now people from Atlanta and, of course, the neighboring states are now able to see this amazing island directly from Hartsfield. So this flight that Delta is now offering every Saturday uh, for the next couple of months is a huge milestone for us. And uh, we're just so excited to have this, uh, this airlift down to Grenada. Look, of course, we've got the who's who here in Atlanta, <laughs> and we've got Miss Yvette. Miss Yvette, do you mind telling everybody on Living Wealthy Always what organization you're with and what you do? Okay, sure. I'm Yvette Caslin. I'm the editor-in-chief of Rolling Out uh, Magazine, as well as Talking Pretty and Hobnob Drive, which is our luxury website. <laughs> well, they have said that they'll be giving out two tickets, so if myself and Yvette can win it, we'll really appreciate it. <laughs> Music is rocking here. Look, this is a one-man band. Yes, okay. Well, look, we're continuing speaking to people here. And, of course, this is a very important man in terms of the Grenadian tourism. He left his country, Barbados. That's how much he felt so passionate about Grenada and the beauty of this island that he left where he left. It's beautiful island because everybody knows Barbados is beautiful. So when you leave Barbados to go to Grenada to become <clears throat> part of the tourism group, you know it says something powerful about Grenada. Let's hear from him now. Please tell everybody who you are. My name is Rudy Grant. I'm the Chief Executive Officer of the Grenada Tourism Authority. And um, Grenada is truly an exceptionally beautiful place. A very, very um, diverse product offering we have in Grenada. You can walk from white sandy beaches into a rainforest within minutes. <laughs> okay, well, is there anything that you would like to tell anybody about your wonderful island? Uh, if you look around, you'll see these pictures right here. Mm -hmm. It's an underwater statue. Mm -hmm. It's real. You have to dive down to see the statues. Uh, if you go online, you'll, you, know, you, you can get all that information. Mm -hmm. About what particular area this is. Right. Fabulous, fabulous. <laughs> We have um, the world's first underwater sculpture park. You can get married in Grenada within 24 hours. Um, you can explore Grenada by going through and utilizing many of the trails that we have. We have quite a number of forts. There's a little something in Grenada for everybody.
like to introduce this beautiful young lady that I've met, if you don't mind telling us your name. It's Karen Reeves with the Boya Travel. Well, I've learned a lot more about Grenada. Oh, okay. Yeah, it sounds like a great place to go, a direct service from uh, Atlanta. So a lot of... Fantastic. To my right here, there's another gorgeous young lady. Mm -hmm. Wanted to ask you, what organization are you with? We're with Today's Spotlight. We're a media outlet here in Atlanta. Oh, fantastic. Mm -hmm. And what, are you blogging? How, what do you Yes, do? yes. We do blogging. We do a lot of uh, red carpet uh, coverage, so reporting, interviewing, things like that. Fantastic, mm -hmm. fantastic. So an event like this, what is this is just you're going to add extra to your media blogs? Exactly. Yes. Okay. And we'll be doing an interview later on with one of the ambassadors as well. Oh, fantastic. Mm -hmm. So yes. you're here to do an interview. Yes, yes. Oh, beautiful. <laughs> You know, as we say, as they say in Georgia, the Georgia peach is sweet. So, <laughs> but uh, welcome. I'm, I'm looking around the room, and I just said to the minister, that, um, I'm seeing some of the best of the best in the industry here in Atlanta. These people sell, I mean, lots for us. Woo! Christine can attest to that. <laughs> But uh, it's hard work and dedication, just adding one more beautiful island to our collection. I'm Richard Pyle, regional sales with Delta Airlines. Ms. Antoine, Grenada's ambassador to the United Nations and permanent representative. Yolen Bain Hosford, Minister for Tourism and Civil Aviation. One of the things you will find when you come to Grenada is that ours is not a destination that is built up. It is not about mass tourism. It is about offering a good, unique, and exceptional, authentic experience. Pure Grenada, the spice of the Caribbean. Well, look, he said it all the spice of the Caribbean. And I'm proud as part of Living Wealthy always to be able to bring you that information because it was very good information. Mr. Grant, yes, 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 yes.